Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read to you a weekly horoscope from July the 15th up to July the 21st and this is for you coming from Taurus. So let's start with the 15th of July which is a Sunday and it's going to be a magnificent Sunday for you. The morning and afternoon periods produce a lot of harmony and whether you are out with your marriage partner and family or romance or working people or business people, you're going to get the advantage and you get to going to get very good news as well. So be out and be in places that makes everybody happy. Yes, you can take the lead and you can make the plans. And yes, you can be a definitely a person who is being looked up to and being loved. So a wonderful time. Now, evening and nightfall is just as good and you will have the, all the plans to your favor and you'll be able to just get along with whoever you are with. Only there is one planet throughout the whole day who is roaming about and this is the planet that makes you stubborn, that makes you dominating, that makes you not flexible, that makes you a person who is too rigid. And so try not to allow that to happen throughout the whole day, especially in the evening and nightfall period. You can meet very important people for any reason that you want. And you can also do make many contacts as well, which are good for you. The problem is that again, this planet of domination and stubbornness will make you behave that way off and on. So remember that and don't allow that to happen. The 16th July, which is a Monday, is a very good morning and afternoon period for you. It produces many global planets. And these global planets will help you to be global. So you may meet people or deal with people, whether on the internet or whether personally or whether through the phone. You will meet people of another race, of another country, talk about business from country to country, talk about products from country to country. So all that is very possible throughout the whole day. Morning, afternoon at your place of work, you'll get plenty of good news through this globalness. So go on the internet for solutions as well. At your place of work, you'll do well on this morning afternoon period. There'll be a lot of uh, people working with you who will help you a lot. And if you are in business, you're going to score very high points and you're going to do extremely well in the morning afternoon in business as well. So give it your best. Right when you get up in the morning, be positive and you'll see that morning afternoon scores very high points for you. Get ready to meet people who can help you. Your evening nightfall period is also very good and your evening nightfall period you can meet people or you could be on the internet to meet people in any area of your life and you will see that you are very happy meeting these people because all these meetings are going to produce some kind of advantage for you. Now throughout the whole day but especially in the evening there is one planet who makes you do things hastily and impatiently and makes you argumentative as well throughout the whole day and especially in the night. So remember that once you get doing these things, try to stop it. Remind yourself that's a problem if I'm hasty, impatient or being argumentative. And so when you stop it, everything comes under control and your evening nightfall will be much, much better. 17th of July, Tuesday is not good for you. In the morning, afternoon, things are very slow because planets are commanded to go slow and that frustrates you. So delays and postponements and cancellations throughout the whole day are going to be the plague. And you will also find that past problems or past news of things will come to disturb you as well. This is also one of them, a planet of depression. So you can feel a bit of depression or sentimentality and this sentiment will of course sometimes bring depression as well, thinking of past mistakes. So it's a very gloomy morning afternoon period. So go slow. You can't go faster than your own planets. You'll be in no man's land. You'll just come back with nothing anyway. So go slow. But even going slow, these are negative planets. So they slowly make things worse and worse. So whatever your responsibilities are in the morning afternoon, take them very seriously because you're going to be plagued with just no help or with things just going very slow and postponements and cancellations. Evening nightfall period, the same news. All the plans you make, you better double check and make sure that things are on track because there's going to be plenty of upsets 
in the evening nightfall period. Again, you might meet people you don't like who have a lot to do with your past. And if you don't want to meet them, don't go out. Go back to the safety of your own home. But if you really have to be out, tell yourself that I'll expect not to receive anything of an advantage, but I'll still go out because the plan's already made. And on this kind of evening nightfall period, it's better for you to not to take charge, not to take charge. So that because whatever you do sometime, somehow will not go right throughout the whole day. There's one planet in the evening and sometimes in the daytime roaming around. This is a good planet, the planet of globalness. So off and on you might get news through the internet of somebody you know which will be very helpful as well. And you might be, meet people evening nightfall of another race or from another country. Things like that are a bit good but overall it's going to be a very frustrating day. The 18th July, for you coming from Taurus now, that's a really bad one. Morning, afternoon of the 18th July is going to be terrible for you. Watch out, getting up in the morning and things go wrong. Driving to work or driving to business, things can go very wrong in the form of accidents. And you'll be a person on this 18th of July who is showing your temper and there's the planet of anger making you angry about something or another. So tell yourself again and again for the morning, afternoon, I must take the soft approach. That's very important for you. I must take the soft approach. Words which are soft, that's what you want to use. A tone of voice which is soft and a body language which is soft. You will override this, these planets and soften them up and then you will get a little bit of advantage. But it's going to be a very tough morning, afternoon session. Bad news is going to come one way or another. So try to keep out of that uh, doing mistakes. Evening, nightfall, the same situation. If you don't have to be out, I'd rather you just go back safely to your own home and be with the people who love you and understand you. Because these uh, planets of aggression, these planets of difficulties, these planets that make you extremely angry, they are all there in the evening, nightfall as well. So you're going to be angry about something or another the whole day, that's the issue. So try not to show this anger because when you do that, you cause provocation. And when you cause provocation, well, everything goes wrong from then. So keep problems to yourself. Try to understand them. Take the soft approach to everything. And hour by hour, you'll just make your way throughout the whole evening, nightfall period and the earlier part of the day as well. 19th of July, Thursday. And I don't quite like these days, but they're okay. They're better than the previous day. All you need not to do is to be arrogant and try not to want to take the limelight. Try not to want to have the last say of about everything. Be flexible, be negotiable, be the nice person and you'll be able to handle your morning afternoon very much better. You can meet very important people throughout the day, even in during the evening nightfall period as well. So back to morning, afternoon, you can meet important people and they will be very helpful to you. But I'd rather you not take the lead too much because a couple of these planets can make you emotionally driven. So you may for the sake of wanting to do something you like to do, but it may not pay dividends. Remember that. Evening, nightfall, these group of planets also follow you there. And there are some emotional planets also waiting for you, emotional night, nightfall. They are very good. So they are waiting to help you and give you some kind of a good deal in the, in the evening nightfall period. So I like you to be out in the evening nightfall period. And you're going to meet people who are very interesting for you. And you'll meet people who can help you. There can be romance in the air as well in the evening nightfall period. The 20th Friday is going to be an exceptionally good day for you. Morning, afternoon, you just get so much help from everybody. Leaving home, you're very happy already. So at your place of work, at your place of business, you're going to get good news. So get ready to go all out. Get ready to put your best. Make the effort of making every hour count. You don't get this sort of days very often. So morning, afternoon, show off your capabilities, project your ideas, send emails, make phone calls, ask favors. And in any area, whether it's a job you want to change, whether it's the business that you want more, whether it's the romance that you want, you are going to get something or another coming your way very nicely. Evening, nightfall, I also like very much. 
and evening nightfall you can meet unexpectedly some very good people but there is also this planet of unexpectedness who wants to bring negativeness to you so he can make you behave in a rebellious way or he can make others behave in a rebellious way one way or another he's a spoiler he's more active in the evening nightfall period so avoid this sort of person and you must avoid being like that as well so don't be rebellious and move along with the plans with others even if you don't like those plans and things will go just fine for you in the evening nightfall period the 21st july saturday and that's a problem morning afternoon many planets make you stubborn basically and they make you dominating which is another form of stubbornness as well and they make you a person who wants to take charge well don't allow that to happen let somebody else take the lead if you are with the people you love or the people you work with or do business with let them take the lead let them make the decisions throughout the whole morning afternoon period and that way you will do much much better and you will have you will have every chance to meet some important people as well in the morning afternoon period is your personality that needs to be toned down and so be flexible and be a person who is negotiable morning afternoon period evening nightfall almost the same planets are there but there is a couple of good planets waiting to welcome you in the evening nightfall period to give you a very good time to give you very good context so evening nightfall same thing don't be stubborn don't be dominating because opportunities are waiting for you in so many ways and you're going to be extremely lucky in the evening nightfall in the sense that these good planets may introduce you to somebody who's important to you okay well that's the week for you and i'm already skyping and i'm charging usd 550 for a 90 minute skype session and during this 90 minutes i'll talk to you about your next 7 or 8 years in all areas of your life and i'll have your date of birth and your time of birth and you will email to me your photos of your palms already by then and i will go into detail age by age and calendar year by calendar year i'll give you a lot of information about your lucky colors lucky directions lucky gemstones a lot more and i'll talk to you about your personal lottery numbers as well based on your date of birth time of birth and your palms so a lot of things will be going on in the 90 minutes to help you keep in charge and be lucky for your next 7 or 8 years so go to skype go to facebook send me a message on email and i'll come back to you as quickly as possible until then thank you and good luck